Radical equation yung ating uh, i-discuss ngayon. May mga ilang problems tayong isosolve dito. Uh, at bago yun, uh, mag-review muna tayo ng uh, laws on radicals and meron tayo dito isang laws ng radicals. Yan, uh, dito, itong ating laws na to ay uh, ito yung law number 1 ng radicals. And dito, yung ating end root of A ay naka-raise sa N. And makakancel out lang itong N na to kaya natira ang A. So, itong example natin dito, uh, try natin i-solve. Uh, dito, mangyayari, ito yung sinasabi, itong 3 na to, itong index, at saka itong exponent na to. Mangyayari kasi, pag isinulat natin yan sa rational exponent, is magiging 3 over 3. Or, ito ay equivalent na sa uh, 5 raised to 1. And, alam natin na pag 5 raised to 1 is 5. Or yan, pwede nga yan sabi ko, kakanselin na lang, matitira yung radigan sa loob, kaya sa loob tayo pahit. So yun lang, ganun lang yun, nireview lang natin. At next tayo dito sa uh, radical equation. Uh, to solve a radical equation, arrange the terms of the equation so that one term with radical is by itself on one side of the equation. Number two, square both sides of the radical equation. 3. Combine similar or like terms. 4. If a radical still remains, repeat step 1, 2, 3. 5. Solve for the variable. And last, 6. Check apparent solution in the original equation. So, okay. Tara. Solve na natin yung problem. Example number 1. We have here na uh, uh, square root of x plus 3 minus 1 is equal to 7. So, first step natin dito, uh, ayan, makikita natin dito, uh, dito mangyayari, combine muna natin yung like terms. So, dito, mapapansin natin, ito lang yung naka-square root. Okay? etong 1 natin dito, hindi siya kasama ito negative 1. So, i-combine natin siya dito. And, pag i-combine, uh, lipat natin siya doon. So, mag-add tayo dito ng 1, and add one tayo dito. Yan. So, ngayon, meron na tayo rito square root of x plus 3. Yan. Diretso na natin. Is equal now to 7 plus 1. And ito, simplify na natin yan. Meron tayong x plus 3 is equal to 8. Yan. Now, kapag ganito na, square na natin both side. Para maalis natin yung radical symbol dito. I-square natin yan. So, syempre, ginawa natin sa left side. Gawin din natin sa kanan. Square din natin yan. Now, etong radical symbol na yan at saka ito, pwede na natin yan makancel. So, meron na lang tayong x plus 3. Is equal now to 8 times 8 o 8 square is 64. Then, same procedure tayo. Uh, combine like terms tayo. Lipat natin si 3. Okay? Sa... So, Negative 3 tayo, and negative 3 tayo dito. Now, meron na lang tayo dito, makakancel na yun. X is equal now to, uh, okay, 61. Kasi, minus natin yun. So, X now is equal to 61. 